I have in my hands the Inmo Air 3. Wow. It's the world's first all-in-one AR glasses, integrating a 1080p full-color waveguide display. It's lightweight, portable, and it doesn't have the bulkiness of traditional AR devices like an extra external device. So it gives you a truly natural wearing experience. This is what they claim. So we'll see, because a lot of AR glasses, they get real bulky. There's a bunch of extra, you know, do you really want to wear this in public? So we'll see if, you know, these guys can beat that public stigma of wearing AR glasses that is preventing most people from actually wearing them on a daily basis because let's be honest nobody wants to be made fun of for wearing AR glasses because they look kind of goofy so maybe these ones will look uh, a little more usable and a little more like normal glasses that's all we can hope for okay let's just go ahead and open it see what they look like look at how fancy that is dude little magnet thing the ring three does it have ring controls what got like a little silicone thing on the back uh some buttons on it yeah this must be like the little controls thing okay that's really cool and we got type a to type c cable respectably long not that long but definitely long enough to actually use and the remote all right let's take a look at the glasses opens the same way so fancy all right We've got a bunch of stuff going on in here. Whoa. Wow. I may look like a bit of a goofball here. They say it looked like glasses. Oh. It's eyewear style. Low profile, stylish, supposed to not look overly futuristic. What do you think? Does it look too futuristic? It's an all-in-one design. You need no phone, no cable connection to use it. It's great for using outdoors and, uh, you know, it's just overall a lot more portable than having to walk around with something like strapped, like a cable plugged in and a little remote. Okay, feature-wise, it's a 1080p Sony micro OLED display with 600 nits peak brightness. It's got a one-dimensional expanded exit pupil waveguide and basically what that means is it's got enhanced clarity and full privacy so no one can see the screen that you're seeing only you can see it it's got a 36 degree ultra wide field of view and that can deliver a cinema grade 150 inch screen massive screen bigger than any tv i've ever had that's for sure it's got a 3d of floating screen with a smart ring it's got three different control modes on it it's got a 16 megapixel ultra wide angle camera and that one's perfect perfect for vlogging and outdoor content. It's got a Snapdragon XR processor and that's got eight gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of storage. Okay, so we're just gonna turn this thing on, see how it works. It doesn't really hurt my eyes. It was a little heavy at first, but I've already kind of gotten used to it. The little pieces that sit on your nose, the little rubber pieces right here, they're pretty um, pretty comfortable. So it kind of just puts it on everything. It's just passed through. You can't see it, but I could see all the apps listed here. There's no screen recording feature, so it's kind of difficult to show you guys. So we're gonna have to put a lot of b-roll and stuff in here but like i said dude this quality is 100 million times better than rokit i wish i could show you you could do a lot of different things with it you could use it for netflix you could use it for tiktok youtube if you want to scroll through tiktok and just lay down and look straight up at the ceiling and just scroll with that you could do that i have it connected to the wi-fi right now no app required this thing's just connected to internet it's got play store on it it's got google chrome on it it's got a built-in camera that can take pictures and videos you can connect it to your pc so you can uh, look at your pc monitor in case you want to do like remote work and you don't want to use your screen yeah you can play games on it we're gonna we downloaded a game from the app store the inmo app store you can switch between multiple tasks in the floating screen like the space multi-screen app you can use it for navigation and fitness outdoors if you want to watch a youtube video while you're jogging outside because you're bored you can do that you can do whatever you want like I haven't tested many competitors, the other, you know, the other guys like Ray-Ban, Meta has some, Xreal, Rokid, uh, Apple. Besides Rokid is the only one that I know that's really trying to, to branch into like glasses that kind of look more realistic, like real glasses. I think the Enmo does a pretty good job trying to make them look more realistic than uh, Apple. Literally, like I said before, it looks like ski goggles. Okay, so this is the smart ring. It's a 3D OF smart ring. It's got three interaction modes. It's got button and touchpad controls. It's got ray interaction for precise interactive control so when you use it to point at stuff basically like your little uh, vr controller it's kind of like a like a mouse interaction sort of with the ring you can control it so that way if you don't want the screen moving with your head or maybe it makes you nauseous or something like that you can pause it leave it somewhere and then when you turn your head the screen will still be in the same spot which is a really cool feature like you want to just put a tv on the wall that only you can see with your glasses and just leave it there and walk away and then come back and it's always playing right there pretty cool you can do a bunch 
bunch of cool stuff with that. I respect that. And it's got AI agent chat GPT, basically an AI agent construction interface. It's mostly a developer tool. It helps in uh, fields like medicine, law, design. So anyways, if you're more interested in the chat GPT stuff, definitely click the link and check that out. All right, actually this kind of helps see the screen a little bit better. When you put the shades on, then, you, then I, I can still see you, but I don't see it as much. It's more like, you know, I have a little bit of a background now. Well, that was the Inmo Air 3. I think they're pretty cool. They look pretty, uh, definitely better than some of the other AR glasses I've seen. They don't, I mean, you know, people will probably tell that you're wearing these. So let's be honest. Uh, they probably know that there's something going on. But it definitely looks a lot more passable than some of the other ones that I've seen. So I, I really like it. The, the picture quality is incredible. Everything being built in with no app, no real external controls, no cables. is just awesome. Like this thing's just connected. I can download any app that I want from the Google Play Store. I can go watch a YouTube video, I could play a game, I could do anything I want on this. It's great. And no one else can see the screen except for me. So if you like ride on a train or whatever, on a bus, like public transportation, or you, you know, you just in a place where you can just kind of kick back, but you don't want to have your phone out, you don't want to be too obvious or be rude or whatever, this is this is kind of pretty good option. I like, can't lie. If you want to just like read a book or, or watch a movie on a big screen or I don't know. Check your stonks. Play some game. Whatever you want to do. I just think it's a really cool idea. So definitely check these out. It's the Inmo Air 3. I'll leave the link in the description. And that's pretty much it. I hope to see you guys in the next video. Thanks Inmo for sending me these. I really appreciate it. Definitely high quality. Keep doing what you do because I've seen way worse. And you guys aren't. You guys haven't released these yet. And they're already uh, 10 times better than some of the AR glasses that I've tested in the past. So hope to see you guys in the next video. Noodle Nick out.